Hello guys, it's Chelsea, your independent Sensi consultant, and welcome back to my channel. So today I've got something I think is pretty exciting, and I think you guys are really going to enjoy too. First of all, I just wanted to say thank you to everybody for who has been subscribing lately and who has been commenting on my videos and taking the time to watch my videos. I so greatly appreciate it, and it means the world to me to see people and interact with other people who love Sensi just as much as I do. Um, so thank you guys so, so much. It, it just means the absolute world to, to me. So, yes. That was the first order of business. Second order of business, I'm officially 37 weeks pregnant today. Whew. I'm there. Um, I had an appointment yesterday. Doctor said, by the looks of everything, I could literally go any day now. So, we're all just waiting. We're waiting for baby boy to be ready. Um, if he decides not to come then we are getting induced two weeks from tomorrow. So exciting stuff, exciting stuff. On top of it, I was going through my wax today and I was getting ready to do a wax change and I was gonna gravitate towards the bars that you guys know I have opened that I'm trying to warm through before I start opening any more bars. And it got me thinking as I was looking at my testers, I was like, you know what? I need to step out of my comfort zone. I love Scentsy, but my comfort zone is I always I always gravitate towards the same scents. You know what I'm saying? Like a, all the bakery scents and like the fresh scents. And I'm not saying that's a bad thing. We all like what we like, but I am one that constantly talks about how do I know if I like a scent until it's warmed up. I could sit here and smell a scent cold sniff and be like, oh, you know, I'm not a huge fan of it, but then put it in my warmer and fall in love with it just, just have another new love scent right and vice versa i could not like it cold sniff uh how, which way did i just say it or like it cold sniff put it in my warmer and absolutely despise it so it is what it is i have really bad heartburn right now guys i'm gonna apologize so after i thought about that this morning i was like you know what i like to warm my testers. You guys know it's probably one of my favorite parts about being a consultant is the fact that we get the opportunity to warm test to purchase testers. We bring these to parties. Um, you know, it gives us a chance to smell scents when they come out, and it's just literally I think it's like the equivalent to one cube of wax, um, one tester. So I was like, that's perfect. Why don't and normally I will melt them. But when I thought about it, I went back on to my workstation and I ordered a whole set of testers. Um, just, just the spring and summer, I didn't just order the transition set. I ordered the full set that comes in that Scentsy tote. If you guys are if you guys are consultants, you guys know what I mean. Because I am starting something new. So I have my Boulder the Bear box, my Scentsy buddy that I purchased for our son. Um, he is in our son's room. So I was like, you know what? I kept the box. I always do. I was like, I'm going to use this for something. And I thought of something that I think is going to be fun. I'm going to start stepping out of my comfort zone. So I opened the box. I went through my whole set of testers. Um, my every scents and the spring and summer scents because they were all mixed in together. And any scent that I have never warmed in a warmer... I pulled out and I thought about it and I thought about it and I was like, okay, girl, it's time to step out of that comfort zone that you're so used to. I'm having contractions guys. So bear with me for a second. If I seem a little, whew. um, I stepped out of my comfort zone a little bit and I took them all out and I'm going to put them in this box. Every week, I'm going to pull out two scents, two scents, and I'm going to warm them in two different rooms. I'm going to tell you guys what I think about them cold sniff, and then I'm going to tell you guys, I'll give you guys a review afterwards on, like, after, like, how, excuse me, how many days the scent lasted, if it was a strong scent, if it was a weak scent, did I like it cold sniff, did I like it warmed up, will I purchase any more, all of that fun, fun jazz so i hope it's something that you guys are going to really really like i'm going to be completely blindsided i'm going to throw all the testers in here and just randomly pick out two cents without looking 
So I already did that today. Um, I had I had the footage. For some reason, we are having like a really bad like it's sunny, but we're having like a really bad windstorm and knocked out my internet. And the the two cents that I had pulled this morning did not um, the video didn't stick. So I will show you the two cents that I have warming right now. I won't really talk about them until that video comes up, but I'm going to show you guys the rest of the testers that are going to go in here. Now, again, it's not just the spring and summer. It's our everyday scents as well, because some of these scents I've never tried because I've never stepped out of my comfort zone. Some of these scents I've just purchased in, um, what's an example, Go Go Mango. I love in our body care line. I love like the, the bath bombs and the Scentsy Soak. However, I've never warmed it, so it's, it's in this pile. That also goes for like Sunkissed Citrus, Blue Grotto. I've never warmed them, but I've used them in like cleaning products and stuff. So without further ado, as I'm contracting and out of breath, there's a lot. There is a lot. Because originally I was going to do one scent a week, but I was like, you know what, girl, you need to do two. Kind of go through it faster. So, oh, this one's a sweater. Um, breakfast blend. Mojito Mambo, Havana Cabana, Blue Grotto, Go Go Mango, Saddle Up, which was um, May's scent of the month, Twitter Pated, Candy Crave, Sea Salt and Avocado, Now and Zen, Sheer Leather, Lilacs and Violets, Paradise Punch, Aloha Citrus, Rainforest Bungalow, Waves and Wonders, Lemon Verbena, By the Sea, Perfectly Pomegranate, Poppy Fields, Be My Honey, Tropic Tango, Weathered Leather, Pineapple Coconut Vanilla, Lucky in Love, Lemon Sorbet, Do We or Don't We, Love and Kisses Mini, Strawberry Taffy, Berry Fairy Tale, Accidentally in Love, Prickly Pear and Agave, Lush Gardenia, Pina Colada Cha Cha, Pineapple Pucker, Ocean, Satin Sheets, Oodles of Orange, Shimmer, <clears throat> Squeeze the Day, which is actually this the scent of the month for this month, Your Pal Mickey, Cinnamon Vanilla, Pink Cotton, Make Waves, French Lavender, Welcome Home, Caramel Sugar Cone, Sunkissed Citrus, Farmer's Market, Camu Camu, Mickey and Mickey Mouse and Friends, and Johnny Appleseed. Let me feel, make sure those are all. Okay, and then the two, I thought I felt another one. And then the two that I pulled this morning that I actually have warming, which they're just going to go in my, my empties bin, so in a couple days I can give you guys reviews on them, is I have Berry of Paradise that's actually going in my room. As you can t see, I, I took the wax out of it. So it is going in my room. I'm not going to give you guys any reviews on it right now, but that is going in my room. And then in our master bath, we have white tea and cactus going on in there. So those were the two that I pulled this morning. Um, I will give you guys the cold sniff review when I smell them again during that review video. But I'm really, really excited to try this, guys, because like I said, I just found myself over and over again purchasing and um warming up the same scents over and over and i honestly like there are so many scents like, like, like oh i like this cold sniff but i should warm it up and see if i like it and then i never get around to it and when you're a consultant and you get your you get the, the opportunity to purchase these things like literally they're so cheap guys um if i just wanted to replace one of these it's a dollar for consultants. I could just place this one, say I only went through white tea and cactus. I could replace this one and it cost me a dollar. If I wanted to replace the entire spring and summer just collection or get a backup, it's like 20 bucks. 
And then to get like the big, a, a nice scentsy tote to get every single scent that we carry in the catalog right now, it's $40. So I just, that's what I purchased this morning because I knew I was taking a lot of them from there. And that way I'm already going to have, ba I already have backups on uh, coming, they're on their way. So yeah, instead of going through and being like, okay, I need this one, this one, this one, it was just cheaper to buy a whole set. So these are the two that I am melting right now, Berry of, Parad Berry of Paradise, White Tea and Cactus, and these are the two that won. I'm pretty excited for this. We shall see how this goes. So real quick, I'm going to close up the box, and I'm actually going to pick the next two scents. What's today? Today's Tuesday, so I should be warming these about Friday. Friday. So these are the scents that I'm going to be melting next. Give her a little jingle. Little jingle. And without looking, the next two scents are going to be... Got two in my hand. Uh oh I think one is going to be like a sun-kissed citrus. I saw that orange. Okay, so the next two scents for Friday are going to be Pink Cotton. Oh, and Do We or Don't We? That's interesting. I'm, I'm really excited about these two scents. So Pink Cotton, Do We or Don't We? These are going to be the scents that I'm going to be melting this coming this weekend. Um, I will be melting these two scents. Hopefully until Friday, if they don't last, I will change them out for one of my wax bars that I'm trying to get through. Get through. As of Friday, we're going to be mel melting pink cotton and do we or don't we. So we'll keep you guys up to date on how these are going. Um, but if you guys are excited for this video and think it's a great idea, please give me a thumbs up. Um, I'm super excited. I wanted to do something out of the box. And like I said, it's a good way to get me to start really experiencing other scents. And why not use the testers because I have them, you know? So thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so um, for more Scentsy videos. Stay tuned for tomorrow, May 26th. I actually have an unboxing for you guys, and I'm pretty excited. Once a month, I'm going to be placing an order, a Scentsy order, and it's going to be strictly no other items but items from the clearance section. I'm gonna do it once a month, um, and tomorrow starts my first one, so tomorrow will be my clearance section unboxing for the month of June. I got some goodies. I really, really hope you guys stay tuned for that. It's gonna be really good fun. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.